Bellator 151 heads to Tackerville, Oklahoma, and it features an intriguing main event. Joe Warren is one of the most decorated fighters in Bellator's history, while Darian Colwell is one of the up-and-comers in the company. Colwell wants to show that he should be up for a title shot, and Warren wants to prove that he has one more run in him. In the co-main event, welterweights Fernando Gonzalez and Gilbert Smith square off. For the bantamweight bout, Warren, who is 13-4, is a former two-division champion at 135 and 145 pounds, and after losing the bantamweight belt to Marcos Galbao in March 2015, he rebounded for a decision win over L.C. Davis in September. Coldwell, who's 8-0, submitted Sean Bunch on the same card in September, and like Warren, he's a wrestler who can't grind you down. The difference here is the age. Warren is 39, while Coldwell is 28. Our pick for this fight is Coldwell. For the welterweight bout, Gonzalez, who's 24-13, has won four in a row, two via unanimous decision and one each by knockout and submission. Smith, who's 12-4, has won four of his last five and he has seven submission wins under his belt. Gonzalez needs a not-tainted win as four of those have been followed by tainted drug tests. However, Smith is a beast who has only been stopped once. Our pick for this fight is Smith. For the featherweight bout, Yamauchi, who is 19-2, is a black belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu with 15 submission wins, but he also has backgrounds in boxing, kickboxing and Muay Thai. Jenkin, who is 10-2, is a NCAA champion in wrestling, but he has worked hard to improve his striking and ground game. This could be the best fight of the night, but Yamauchi, who is vastly underrated, gets the edge because of his versatility. Our pick for this fight is Yamauchi. For the second bantamweight bout of the night, Taim Anglo, who is 21-6-1, lost his bantamweight debut against Rob Emerson, but he has won two straight since, and while he has 11 submission wins, he beat Antonio Duarte in May for his fifth knockout win. Kakai, who is 12-3, fell to Frankie Zions in a split decision in August in the UFC, and he would like to make an impression in his Bellator debut. He has four knockout wins and six submission wins, and he has never been stopped in 15 pro fights. Our pick for this fight is Kakai.